good morning, afternoon, evening, whenever you're watching this, ladies and germs. <laughs> That'd be my sexy face. Anywho, as I've mentioned before, I've been, been, been a little slacking in uploading Let's Play videos lately, but I do have some good news. We are switching internet providers sometime this month. It's the company that's hopefully going to give us a lot more bang for our buck when it comes to the data plan. So hopefully I should have a better schedule of uploading maybe one or two Let's Play vids a weekend or so. Like, you know, depending on how big they are and all that jazz. Though I just thought in the meantime I would give you a little taste of what's coming up, as in what games I have captured video files for that I do hope to plan to do the voiceovers and all that eventually, so... Let's see what we got here. First off, Dead Time Stories, the last chapter of it. Yes, this is my first Let's Play from way, way, way back before I figured out how to properly use a microphone and all that shit. And as you may not know, uh, the last section I had the uh, Fraps screen capture didn't capture it quite properly, so... That game kind of got put on the back burner, but now I have a proper video of the final chapter, so yes, this will soon be complete. Ha 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 ha. And Dream Day Wedding to kick off the trilogy of games that will finish off the Dream Day series. So, like, there's, yeah, three games you, yes, yes, yeah, could kind of say that the first three games in the Dream Day series, they all deal with the same couple, so as you help them get married and go on their honeymoon and build their first home. Aw, in neck is so. Yep, have that on the plan, so well, all seven Judean games, boom, off the plane, off the plane. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, all seven Dream Day games will be done. Sadly, there's not any more. You think there'd be a market for more of these? Like, I know, maybe Get Married in France. Or Dream Day Baby Shower. Maybe. Come on, come on. Just this idea. And gotcha! Celebrity Secrets, where you, as you can see, play a paparazzi. <laughs> Expect a lot of topical wink-wink, nudge-nudge humor going on in here. Yeah. And... Oh boy, the, the the this this is just weird. There is this site with these uh, flash games based on Frozen. I'm gonna guess they're very unofficial, and let's just say the princesses have been struck with a lot of medical maladies. <laughs> yeah, I know uh, PewDiePie has already played some of these, but this is gonna be a much longer uh, series. Like, well, longer. Well, it's gonna take gonna take a couple of videos at least, but they're gonna be pretty long. So where I played through a lot more of the games than he did, <laughs> expect a lot of uh, WTFing because pff, holy shit! <laughs> and over here, the Twilight Zone. Yes, there recently was a hidden object game based on the classic Twilight Zone series. Uh, apparently, there was also some Atari like. Game back in the 80s or something, where the, this is when I was looking for screenshots, but... Yep, The Twilight Zone. I haven't actually watched a uh, whole lot of the uh, classic Twilight Zone lately, so I don't know how... Um, I don't know how good my commentary is going to be on this one, but... <laughs> whatever, let me... Look at, look at that graphic. Look at those graphics. Those look great already. I mean, going to be a great vid. Okay. Next up, Les Miserables, Cassette's Fate, and Jean Valjean. Yes! Believe it or not, two hidden object games based on the Les Miserables novel, although these came out after the movie. So yeah, based on all because there's some mentioned some events in the novel that didn't quite make it into the musical. <laughs> La -da 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 <laughs> yeah. Uh, they'll make a game out of anything. And here we are. Sims Life Stories, these Stories games that uh, came out around the same time as Sims 2, so they're kind of like mission-based versions of The Sims. 
And I know there's also castaway stories and pet stories, but I haven't found any copies of those yet. That, that should be fun to see if we get any funny glitches. <laughs> and next up, this Love Story Trilogy. As you can see, they're all centered around some old ladies and the memories of lost loves and stuff. But they're not the same old lady, as kind of figured out. So, they're nice graphics. Get a, get, get a nice good love story going on in there. <laughs> I am such a girl. Okay. And, oh boy, this uh, mysterious uh, city trilogy that came on some bundle pack of mine. Uh, these... Uh, I didn't really quite enjoy these as much. I mean, you're Probably gonna say, as I can see, the graphics are kind of graphics are a little shoddy, but <laughs> whoa, excuse me. <laughs> and you'll, you'll, you'll know, you'll know when I get there. And next up, my name is Addiction. Uh, this I found on one of those free sites. You probably might have heard of this. A uh, choose your own adventure thing about sex and porn addiction. Addiction. <laughs> And for one thing, holy hell did I not enjoy that this is one of the most pretentious pieces of crap I have ever had the misfortune of coming across. Holy shit! Oh my god, you oh god, you're gonna get a lot of vitriol in my commentary there. And another thing is like seeing as the theme is sex addiction, you can guess that some of the the visuals in here are going to be a little risque, and I know I can censor some of it, but even if I censor, I don't know if I'm still going to be able to put it on my YouTube, like even even under a mature filter and censor all that, so I might have to make them downloadable. Eh, let's, um, yeah, let's see. So, yeah, that's going to be fun. And last but not least, some games that I'm not quite sure if... They're actually going to become episodes, but I'm still, you know, getting the video files for them anyway. And one is Ghostmaster. You may have heard of this. It was supposed to be built up as like the next, the next Sims, but yeah, you know, it didn't go over so well. So like your ghosts and your haunted people, it's 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 not bad per se, but. It does have its little flaws, which I will point out as I get there, and holy Hannah, one of the levels, I think it was in the hospital, that took me almost two hours to get through. So, yeah, the video video files, like, yeah, hour and 45 minutes. I don't know if I'm going to have to, like, crop it down or do some fast-forwarding <laughs> if, if I ever do make a Let's Play out of that, so. Now, Hell's Kitchen, the game... Yeah, yeah, like I said, they they made games out of anything. This uh, mission based thing where you know you just gotta make your dishes in make your dishes in time without pissing off the customers and you got look at the look at the forehead crease on Ramsey there. <laughs> oh, like also this is a hard ass game. I mean I guess they're really trying to replicate what it is like in the Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> And let's get Wizard Academy, and its sequel, Wizard Academy 2. Now, the thing is, these would make perfect episodes because, like, if you have, like, uh, played or seen anything in Magic Academy, the visual styles, they are ripping off the Harry Potter movie so much, there is so much fodder for jokes. But, as you can see, when I do games in the series, I do like to... You know, have both series up, and for Magic Academy 2, there is this one puzzle near the end I am having the hardest time with. I can't skip by it. So, yeah, I don't know if I'm ever going to be able to finish that and able to put up the first video series, too. But I am going to try. So, uh, like I said there, that's what I have uh, planned upcoming for when... My internet stops being a little shoddy, so like, anywho, f uh, at this count, 54 subscribers and almost 
24,000 views. I mean, holy, holy Hannah, that, did, that, <laughs> that is pretty freaking awesome. Uh, so I'd really like to thank you guys for watching and all that jazz. So I will hopefully see you later and...